what was school like for you? Was there, were you in the popular group or? I was in the popular group, but not because I was attractive or whatever. Like I was that quirky, funny girl that everyone wanted around because they felt better about themselves. Yeah. I was really, <laughs> honestly, I was always the girl where I'd, I'd fall in love with a guy and he'd be like, oh my God, I'm so glad we're friends because I love your friend. And I'd be like, oh. oh isn't that the worst? Yeah, I didn't even like boys really. Go and then I just got over them. But um, yeah, I was quite curvy and all my friends were like stick and bottles yeah. and because yeah. my self-esteem was quite good, I'd hang out with them and they used to get picked on, like my friends that used to do modelling so much. Really? Yeah, a lot, like a lot of bullying with attractive girls. And wow. I saw it all and sat back and it was just really interesting because I wasn't a threat to anyone. Yeah, right. So, um, yeah, watching it, I wasn't bullied really at school oh, by boys because yeah, they had yeah, really yeah. big boobs. Um, did you? I was yeah. that girl too. I got boobs first. I got my period first. Like oh, did wait. you? Yes. Oh, see, I couldn't wait for boobs and it felt like I prayed too hard where over Christmas I came back and just went, what did you do, God? Yeah, like I just right. Went from stick skinny to just massive. Massive boobs. Yeah. Yes, I didn't, I didn't, I, now I would do anything for big boobs, but back then having boobs was like, no, I didn't want them. But did you want them and then they came and you didn't want yeah, them? Yeah, I didn't want them at all after that because it brings all this unwanted attention that yeah. everyone treats you different and boys are looking at you different and yes also I remember doing a tap concert um, because I did tap dancing right. um, and uh, all the girls had like no boobs and had like sequins over their thing and I came out and they had to change the whole costume because it was like a stripper oh really? yes and all the, all the dads <laughs> I caught one of the dads once I, I went over to my friend's house and he's watching my video on slow-mo with a beer Shut up. Yes, and I thought, oh, how sweet. Now I look back and go, what a freaking sleaze. How's that? And I was like, oh, he loves my tap dancing. I like just love seeing your boobs move. Yeah. I remember a boy in assembly pinned my bra oh, and I, so I didn't bad. want to go back to school for like a week. I yeah. Like, this is mortifying. Like your body changing is so intense at that age when you're just navigating I'd the world say and then you're like. Of everything I've gone through in my life, that was the hardest thing. I agree. Teenage. I totally agree. And, and if only kids knew how much better it gets. Like, and I yeah. mean, all the picking on of the press, the media, mm. all that is nothing compared to school. Really? Yeah. Of the pressure of thinking you don't fit in and you're different and whatever. Yeah. yeah. I'd say 16, 15, 16, 17 was harder than anything I've been through.